Hello everybody, I hope you're having an amazing Sunday. My name is Demulius. It's time for XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. Now, last episode we had a... well, last Tuesday we had two uh, uh, two missions. One which uh, uh, went well until we ran into the Berserker Queen. And, and the next one was a very successful uh, VIP mission. And at the end of last episode we got another VIP mission. So that's what we're going to be starting with today. Get a council mission. Neutralized target. Supplies and intel. It's in the region of the assassin. So what I'm worried about is that this is in the region of the assassin. The berserker queen is still running around. My fear is that Setting we'll all, all the get them African at the sector. same bloody time. And uh, yeah, that'll be kind of devastating. So I hope we don't get that. But uh, I'm going to try and uh, set up a squad to. Uh, for success. Operation Dawn Hand. Sending the Jaeger, Tiny, Patty, Bandit, Bones and Prophet. I am not really happy with the squad, but it's the best that I can do and I'll show why I'm not happy with this. Tiny is a fear of missed shots. Patty has a fear of panic. And Bandit has a fear of Archons. Fully half of our squad has a fear. Yeah, that that's really bloody dangerous. So he can panic when he fires a shot and misses. Actually, is that only him? Okay, I'm not quite sure if he also can panic if someone else misses a shot. If that's the case, I'm really fucking screwed. He has a chance to panic when other people can panic. So uh, that's, you know, very convenient for someone who is our medic and who actually has an ability to remove panic from other people, but you know. <laughs> and he has a fear Archon, so if he sees an, even sees an Archon, he can panic. Now, I've taken some uh, blue screen rounds and uh, a P EMP grenade, I don't got bombs yet. In case we run into another, uh, what's it called, Sackpot? And we're taking our new uh, Templar out for a spin. So, uh, wish me luck. Sky Ranger deployed. In position for deployment. Yeah, let's begin the mission. The resistance has been after an alien collaborator for some time now, and they finally got a solid lead on their location. They're asking for our help in ensuring the target is dealt with, so we're moving in to secure the area. Neutralize all hostile forces standing in your way. If possible, Capture the VIP alive. Oh, that's a Ball very nice scene fails. where he's located. Take Holy shit. Menace one five, target location confirmed. Move to engage. Good. Eliminate all hostile contacts. Good thing is the timer doesn't start Let's until uh, we we get revealed. And we've got two more turns thanks to our uh, assistance uh, I am on the abilities. Move. So I think it's a good idea to make use of that. Let's see if we can find anything. Don't like half of my squad sitting around an explosive trike, but uh, we haven't been discovered yet, so... Nope. Ah, we got a fucking Archon. They patrol blindly ahead. Okay, he resisted. That's something. Okay, so how do we want to do this? I think a good opening move would be to move her towards the side, or maybe even move her that way. Because if they're go if they're gonna come for us, they're gonna come into us in a, in a straight uh, path, probably. So if we stand over there, I think the odds of being Moving discovered are going to be smaller. And we discovered something else. Or is that yeah? That's the same guys. Okay. That's all we can do. Does ourselves a little claymore here. Actually, we might not even need to do a claymore. We can just start with uh, with our grenadier. 
He only has one plasma grenade. But I think uh, we've got plenty of plasma grenades on other people. Wait, who's this? What the hell happened to our armor? Okay, that's weird. Uh, let's see, because if we do a uh, plasma grenade, these two are going to fall to the ground to take further damage from that. Plasma grenade is going to remove all their armor. They're going to take full damage, the Archon doesn't, but he's probably going to then close with us. Uh, do I want to do it now or do I want to take a little bit more time to set up actually? Good to go. Mm, we got time actually, so we can just do things slowly. Oh, fuck me. I have sight beyond vision. This is the shot we've been waiting for. Take that thing down before it has a chance to run. Are they standing next to a car over there? Yes, they are. <laughs> Okay, that would kill the uh, Berserker Queen, I think. Or at the very least do some serious damage. It would kill one of the mutants. And so long as we still got concealment, I think uh, she's gonna go on a, on, a, on a killing spree and just kill everything that's inside, so... You know what? Let's go for it. If it kills loot, then so be it. But I wanna do this mission as safely as I possibly can. Watch closely! One of them came back for more. Let's make sure to take it out this time. He has four health, so if it decides to come our way, then we can, you know, just tear the blood in one. But we still got concealment, so let's make use of that, shall we? Uh, I think spreading out is probably a good idea. Position I like. You still got concealment, so I like your position. Well. Oh, no. Let's just stay put. I will sense any See what the Berserker Queen is gonna do. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Saw some targets uh, way in the back over there. Uh, he doesn't know where we are, so he's. Um. So let's trigger these guys. If the Berserker King does come up, we can kill her with a single shot. Come on. Wait, let me first check, see if uh, these guys are gonna keep their cons are gonna lose their concealment. And these two are aren't. All right. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, he still has consumer. Very good. I think if we move there, we trigger the Berserk Queen. But that's fine. Heading there now. Take a shot at the Berserker Queen. Hmm. What about a normal shot? That you can. What we can also do. Can you see the Berserker Queen? Three to four. Are you fucking shitting me? Okay, Berserker Queen is not close by enough that uh, he can see her. Okay. 
You are motherfucking kidding me. He can move and attack. Fucking bullshit. Kill this bitch. So we don't have to worry about them anymore. I would be curious to hear her reasoning. Although I would question uh, whether reason was ever involved in this decision. He's just uh well he has some minor damage and he is uh let's see, what we wanna do first, because we can move into the shield bearer, slash him in the face. But if we do that he might uh, come join in, so Okay, shield bearer is going to slash anyway. That's pretty much a given. This world is ours. So let's weaken this guy up a little bit. How much damage can we do to this guy? Oh, that's some fairly decent damage. With a decent chance of hitting as well. <laughs> and he's executed, okay. I will reposition. We wanna scout ahead a little bit with him. Wait, does he have a I am at your service? Oh, no. Not sure why, because we haven't killed anything with him this this episode. Okay, if he moves he gets revealed, so... Yeah, there goes the shield. There comes the muton. And he did a double move, okay. Can I go home now? I think it's time to go. Fuck. He can't use his clay mark, so considering he's disorientated. Uh... Let's start with you then. I will tear you apart. Guaranteed damage is always good. We can use this concealment. He can uh, he can reconceal anyway. Getting in close. Let's get a kill with him. Getting it done. I'm spotted. Just wondering, do we still get? No, you no longer get the bonuses from being. That was some serious trick shot. <laughs> Target down. And again, we don't get a bloody. You know what I'm talking about? Okay, uh, let's see. It's to a revival protocol, so Bones can toss this uh, Claymore. Oh, he can actually take a shot himself. But first, we already got loot, so we can just do a remote start kill him. But I actually want. Someone else to get the kill, so what we can do is blow up both. A delicate placement. So that may, that way we may still get explosion damage, but it shouldn't shouldn't outright kill him. Oh fuck, we didn't blow up this cover. That was I have little ammo remaining. And now suddenly uh, not this fucking shit again. So bloody annoying. Hey, you're still standing in the same spot. Actually, nothing happened, but you suddenly can't see the guy anymore. <sighs> okay. Um. Mm. Actually, I don't want to lose that consumer. That seems like a shame. Got it. 
Do we want to take the shot? No, no, we really don't. This was a decent shot though, so let's try that. And we get him. Very good. Let's move up. Okay, there's the last squad. Got ourselves a heavy mech and two troopers by the looks of it. Are they by any chance standing to something explosive? No, no, they aren't. That's a shame. Got a guaranteed sh shot at this one. But what I'm thinking, fire at the heavy mech, make them come to us and blow both of them up with a single EMP bomb. That's a nice hit. Rüstung wurde getroffen. Uh, where are you? Okay, you are going to move up a little bit. Roger that. Yeah, like that. Grenade out. Hello there, friend. Enjoy your waves. Yeah, the turret shut down for two turns, so we no longer have to worry about that for the time being. That's fair to... Oh crap, the thing has fucking five armor. Um. How do we want to deal with that? We can just come with protocol. I think come with protocol in them is probably not a bad idea, as it's guaranteed to hit. Seven to eight damage is maybe a little bit overkill against something that still ha only has two health, but it has four armor, so yeah. There we go. Closing on target position Third will now. shut down for two turns. This car can't explode anymore. And ooh, that's it. Not a very decent shot, actually. I mean, if it crits, it is, but... Uh, do we want to conceal first? I think that gives us like 25% aim and stuff, and some crit. Mm. You know what? Why not? Now you see me. <laughs> nice. At least means that we are... Jesus Christ. At least means we are using Shadow Strike. They wrong to me. Yep. Ah oh, crap. Enemy eliminated. But well, we got a flanking shot. Uh, let's move up. Because we are in, in range to uh We can fire the pistol though, that's uh or do we want to hunker down? Where's that last soldier? I mean, he's up there. This is a safe position. Move in to designate. So with him, we might as well take a shot at the turret. It hit the plate. Ah. Uh, yeah, setting all its armor. We are we're only going to do. Well, nothing to it. Uh, I think this guy is going to move up here, so I think her, her position is kind of compromised. He's probably going to go in this direction as well. So why don't we put her 
inside here. No, wait, that's gonna. She's gonna get revealed from the uh, VIP. Uh, just go and Overwatch then. Always vigilant. You lucky bastard. You can never escape my sight. Three to five. So if, if he does six damage, then he kills it. Now slash it. Feel the power of the Templars. Crap, we get a crit. <laughs> nice. So, some focus on her. Does he have? No, he doesn't have run a gun yet. Okay, what well, we can do. Slash this guy in the face. It's guaranteed to hit. And then take the sh flanking shot with her. I uh, think it was she. Let's go! He's also burning. Nice for us, not so much for him. Volk says I am to obey. You will never hide from me. Yeah, that's our. Target identity confirmed. Okay. So it's guaranteed to hit, but we don't need actually do any damage considering all its armor. Get this crits though. Ho, ho, ho. And it doesn't. But if it would have crit. Let that happen again. At the very least, he didn't get revealed. Easy, he actually. Uh, wow, this is an insanely good shot considering the guys in full cover. Alright. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um. Heading you move up. Now. Take out the turret if you can. Which you can. Nice. Okay. Do an 8 protocol on Bandit. Considering he now is a zombie uh, standing right next to him. And even though we still have 10 turns left, I want to move up. Considering I have the feeling that we might. Uh, actually. There's a, there's a hack target. Let's take, take a look at what that does. Reduce enemy will by 50%, guaranteed. I don't think there's actually any. Other enemies left on the map, I don't think. But if you do do this, then you uh, sh should get get like a list of who who, who has their wheel reduced. Wait, didn't I go for it? What? Okay. Thought I went for the left one. Infiltrazione nel sistema in corso. Tutto fatto. Well, I don't get control of anything, so I I think it's safe to assume that there are no other enemies. Okay. Nice shot, zombies down. Gotcha. Eat everything. Okay, let's take a look here. I see a purifier, a mech, and a lancer. Okay. A lot of shots missing. Actually, can't we Chris blow that bike that's already firing? Oh, we can. <laughs> Won't hit any of our guys. Nope. 
Please observe your surroundings. I love remote start. Oh fuck. Purifier also yeah. Shit. Understood. Moving out. I'm burning up here. You're burning up, but you are not gonna be taking damage from this considering we are evac. VIP secure and in position for evac. This is Firebrand. VIP is secure. Okay. Guaranteed kill. Up to dusk and see. Blue skin rounds really are amazing. I think he can move up and take a dusk flanking pistol mind. shot. Oh, right, this thing is really not upgraded yet. However, he can get a kill now. You will pay the price! Oh, you are fucking kidding me. Struck their armor. Uh, he doesn't have a. No, he doesn't have stock, but he does have gun protocol. Vado in posizione. Holy crap! Is it a guarantee that they're gonna raise? Because I think most of them we've seen standing up are like. Can't I don't know. Okay. I'm coming home. Show up. So, Observer Queen Making is no longer escape. an issue. Packing it in. And we completed this mission pretty Mando. damn nicely, I'd say. No one died, and the wounds that we did get uh, shouldn't take them out of that action for too long. Mission accomplished. Let's see if we can get a nice uh, picture going. <laughs> I love this. Alright. Officials announced an increase to this month's recruitment quotas. Citizens are encouraged to voluntarily visit their nearest recruitment center. Remember, only together can we build... As long as there is even one Reaper left standing, you can bet there's still... Okay, we got some promotions in very early. Let's see here. Well, he's a pistolier, so face off. Bandit, let's see. Let's go for implacable. And sting. I'm gonna go for a sting. I think needle pairs well with this as well. Considering you have a guarantee that you're not going to go out of shadow. Uh, for, for, for those few times where you just have to uh, like shred off some uh, armor piercing. And if you also do it after someone else's threat, etc. I'm going to do more damage as well. And soul harvest. And so let's pick this one up as well. We, we, we had some uh, points. When we started we actually only had 7 AP points. I think we got like... I think five for killing uh, the ruler. Then. So uh, yeah, we earned some of this mission. Very good. Commander, having successfully recovered one of Dr. Valen's genetically modified test subjects, I am eager to begin conducting an autopsy as soon as possible. It is my hope that by following her own research notes, I will gain an even greater understanding of just how she managed to accomplish these rapid changes. Being a mad scientist? Hello, Commander. Very nice. So, it's a good thing that we managed to keep the... Uh, let's actually quickly take a look and see if we got any 
new special abilities available to me now. Oh, wait, he actually didn't get a promotion. Uh, he got deep cover. I think this actually pairs down if you go on Overwatch. So you can go on. Oh, holy shit, look how many AP he got. He did not have this many, so I think he got a lot from that promotion. Um, Rupture is also very good though. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna consider what I'm gonna do with that one. Not gonna take uh, the. Uh, just yet. Uh, he didn't get a promotion actually. Bandit did get one, and he can get Guardian. Hmm. Considering we build him for stealth, that's not the best of abilities. If we, at some point in the campaign, can't get Rupture for him though, that's going to be insanely good because that's guaranteed crit. Which, uh, aside from you know the other uh, benefits that the Rupture show gives, obviously. So we got three people who got promotions. Other was Bandit. Uh, yeah, yeah. Who was the other one? I think there was a Reaper. Yeah, there was a Reaper. Okay. No. All right. So we're done with the promotions, and uh, let's continue on to the Geoscape. Alright, so we got a supply drop available, a disabled truck for more supplies. But what I first want to do is visit the black a market. New because we got a boatload of intel at our disposal. Let us see if we can buy any uh, alloys. Well, yes, yes we can. But only 35 intel as well, nice. That means we can get some uh, gear uh, upgrades. Uh, what else can we get? Hmm. Okay, I'm considering this one, but I think we have to hold on to our supplies to make contact with the new regions. So, let's first um, hey, give Commander. ourselves some weapon upgrades, shall we? So, let's see, these are pistols. Uh, considering the large amount of pistoliers that we actually get, that might be a good idea. This gives us a, uh, a good fusion axe to work with. Also one of the weapons I haven't been able to use yet, considering that I hadn't grabbed it yet. Uh, how much supplies is that? Or rather, I think I can better look at the alloys. 10. Gives still 26 to work with. Um, so we can instantly upgrade to the Shadow Keeper, but I think going for the, the fusion axe might be a better idea. We already have the melee weapons upgraded. Uh, a Templar pistol for the. Uh, it's not that important, but I think upgrading our skirmisher might be a good one. So that's 20. Then we still have 16 supplies, alloys left. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, but let's go for those. And, we'll and maybe we want to hold on to the, those 16 while we wait for the storm gun uh, to be completed. I think a better idea than to upgrade the other ones that we currently got. Uh, um, currently don't need to scan for those supplies, but we could. My of your crew. Loot might also be Illyrian Force. Yeah, please don't. Commander, there were a few wounded during the latest covert okay. action, but after a few days rest, Everyone will be ready to get back out there. Not very good. We both gained XP. Uh, she gained some aim. And we gained an engineer. And... We should have... I think this all should be new, right? Uh, we started up the last thing uh, before we actually got our, uh, the end of the month, if I remember correctly. So I'm going to take a look here and see if there's anything interesting. Alright, so we're going to go for this one. This will give us another resistance contact, which is always going to be useful. We'll give Corporal Emma a promotion, and these guys have good uh, good synergy. And it was very cheap to remove the, the chance of being captured, so that's one of the reasons is our specialty. why I went for that Just one. Hope your people can keep up. Oh, they'll be able to keep up. 
Shadow Chamber now operational. Oh, sweet. What I like the most about the Shadow Chamber is that we get a preview of what enemies are going to be on what mission, which will be really bloody helpful. So, let's see here. Uh, yeah. Where's the train? Is idle? What? Did we just... Yeah, wait, what? Why does it say that resistance ring is idle? Because it really isn't. That's the proving ground. Uh, okay. Sure. Let's go for some more loot. No sanctuary for uh, those who would stand in open defiance of the elders. They will suffer in the endless oh, fields of the void. What was the the chosen are gonna do whatever it takes to get to ah, command. Even if remote. that means wiping out entire camps of Speaking resistance of supporters, traits. we're their only line of defense. You have to remove more of these blast negative traits. There were some casualties during that last covert action. She did get a promotion, though. Our troops will all recover after some well-earned rest. Okay, there was another one that I found interesting. I think there was this one, because it gave you hacking. So let's see if we can assign a specialist. Let's see here. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. There you go, and we have enough crystals to assign to that. Our order is clear. There we go, and I think I saw another pop-up. I think there was uh, that people were done uh, bond training. But we don't got any other bonds that we can uh, investigate. Anyway, there was something over at the armory. Mysterious stranger. We got an advanced repeater, advanced scope, and an advent data pad. I was hoping for Delirium cores, but I'm not going to look at the doors in the mouth. What do you with these simple machines, Commander? Storm gun in one day. So let's go to the sprinkler. It is of no concern. Hmm. I think he's talking about the shadow chain. Oh, sweet! And the storm gun is done. I do, Commander. All right. Uh, these all take a really bloody long time to. Uh... Oh wait, this is uh, inspired. Um. I think most days take, most researchers take pretty, oh fucking hell, powered armor, we need more alloys for that. And we're already going to get the storm gun, so let's actually I go for this one. Word as soon as so we, have something we can note. hopefully use those uh, uh, intel points to, uh, to grab more, uh, oh wait, I know why it's this. To grab more uh, things from the, the black market uh, next month. Flash. Oh... Now, let's see if she has any nice abilities. Where is she? Flash. Uh, no, she, she's, she's gonna have to be a captain before she can get the next one. Alright. Oh, it's Storm Gun, Storm Gun, Storm Gun. Let's build the bloody Storm Gun. New Engineering, now. build items, storm gun. There we go. We still have six alloys left. We can actually get the uh, powered shadow keeper. Hmm. Uh, this is not the mag rifle for uh, for the reapers, so I'm quite sure why that. I think we have to res. Oh, I think uh, the research for the uh, Reaper Sniper Rifle is probably the same one as the normal Sniper Rifle. But, like I said earlier, we have a lot of. Uh, can we afford to spend these supplies on this? Uh, I don't know. You know what? Why not? It is a very good pistol. And it, it actually doing, you know, relevant damage might not be a bad idea. Oh, it's fucking nothing hell. on this end. All systems check out. It's almost as if our own signal is bouncing back at us. Oh boy. Perimeter alarm. 
Looking for a breach. Almost got it. There. It's one of those things. That can't be good. So what are effects the drama the the These are the tactical Mac. projections for our next field elite operation. Officer, elite purifier, elite lancer, archon, viper, muton, chrysalid, enemy unknown. The, the enemy unknown is a gatekeeper. Okay. Are we also facing a sector pod? I actually didn't check that. Elite shield bearer code. Excellent. Okay, so for our first squad we are taking Freya, Scratch, Fury, Jaeger and Flash. I've just uh, given them uh, the uh, their bond, which they actually got after that one <laughs> single op that I sent them on, so that's nice. Uh, pa -pa 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 -pa. I think this is everything, yeah. For the next squad I'm gonna have to uh, put in a few specialists, or at the very least two. And I think that's about it. Uh, Start with fuck negative trade zone removal. Okay, uh, on COVID. Oh, you're fucking shitting me. You are really fucking shitting me. The only one I got available is, is a motherfucking squaddy. Okay, so for the next squad, I'm taking Pale Rider, big money. I'm taking two squaddy specialists because, yeah, fuck my life. We have no specialist available who has more than one uh, heal. So we are royally screwed if people get wounded. And we are taking prop. No, wait. That's the wrong one. And we are taking bones to do the scouting for us. Let's launch this mission. Yeah, boy. It's going to be a matter of time, though, considering the second I saw that he had like done all his research and shit, I kind of knew he was going to come for us. But yeah, we weren't really in a position to uh, take the war to him just yet. So yeah. Attention all hands. This is not a drill. The Chosen are attempting a ground assault on us with heavy weaponry. Prepare to defend the ship. We have to take out that gun. Okay. The enemy turrets are hammering the ship. We have to take them out before they breach our hull. Hmm. Commander, that Chosen brought some sort of massive artillery cannon with it. There's no way we can take off while that thing is operational. They're powering the cannon with a supplementary yep. generator on board Get the truck. It will probably take them some time to build the charge. So if we can take that thing out, the cannon itself will be useless. Well, that's a challenge now, isn't it? So, I want to thank everyone for tuning in. Next episode, we're going to be uh, well, doing this mission. <laughs> See you guys next time.